Don Lemon, you know Don Lemon, right? That's a gay dude on CNN, right? He got in trouble for like misogynistic text. Can you Google search that? Yeah, can we, can Don, we bring just up search these transcripts? Don Lemon misogynistic text. All right, got you. Give me one second. It's putting on the um the timestamp. No, oh, yeah. But so, <laughs> like, it was incredible to read, right? So I guess you know he's been talking shit to his employees, being sassy. You know what I mean? And everybody's like mad at him. But I'm just reading this like, wow, like, you know. How you spell misogynistic? <laughs> There's a Y in there. I think. Yeah, it's a Y yeah, it's, instead of that. Yeah, I know. That's what I did at first. But that's not right. <laughs> I think it's. A, Google got it. Yeah, Google got it. This is the first time Lauren hasn't been able to spell something. That's actually impressive. Yeah. It took I, this long. I, I Nigga, shout out to you, <laughs> the education system you came up in, and your parents. You shouldn't know how to spell that word. That's a bad yeah, word. Nah, you're not a but, misogynist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You should know how to spell that word. You respect bitches. Well, let 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 the world tell it. I'm I'm one of those. Exactly. Sexist behavior. Mm-hmm. Can a gay man be sexist? Yeah. No, but yes. He hmm. like he can be uh You know what's crazy? Before we left my crib, I air fried two slices of pizza. <laughs> that shit done, nigga. That shit brown. Nah, it's not burnt. I put a timer on it, but it's just like I ain't eat that oh, shit. Oh, you got one of those? I got one of those I'm ovens too. To that. Damn. Fuck. You niggas gotta be big. Shout out Papa back. John's. But it's actually take that back. Yeah. They ain't paying ah. for that. Fuck. Yeah. Niggas be shouting niggas out. Niggas eating Skittles on his. Yeah, it, we already <laughs> fucked up. But it's I was kind of like sad about what, it because what did he say? Don, bro, he was talking crazy to the white women. Like he was of course they didn't reveal the text. But imagine a sassy black man. And he was talking shit. Mm-hmm. That's you know the next I mean? best thing to getting shit talked to by a black woman. Exactly. But what's, like, isn't this what they asked for? Who? Like, America. Yeah. Like, if they you. If, diversity and inclusion. If you want diversity, there's certain things that come with having different cultures. Because being a gay black man is like a whole other thing. That, it's a responsibility. Like, literally. You have certain etiquette that you have to uphold. <sighs> And then, like, you know what I mean? You had to be the first one complaining. And then a, a week, like a month before this happened. You got to have a good sigh. If you a gay black man. Yeah. You got to be able to deflate your tires, like, on the fucking whim. Nigga. Yeah, Wait, yeah. is this what he said, bro? Did, did he? Is it because he said somebody is not in their prime? Not in their prime of what? Pussy, like, looks? It's just in general, like. <coughs> that, that might, that, no, you know that scene is a misogynistic thing, to say a woman is not in her prime. Yo. You know that, right? Oh, uh, that's misogynistic, and but it's better that he's gay though, right? Because yeah, because it's almost. What is he saying that she went through menopause? She hit the wall. But the prime thing is weird because everybody has a prime. Yeah, and everybody's prime is different. Exactly. But the Nikki we Haley. We wouldn't die if we we wouldn't age like, and die. Literally, if was good. literally, like when you get older, you're not in your prime anymore. Like, mm. It literally happens. Like I can't jump the same way you're that slow. I could yeah. when I was twenty. Yeah. Facts. You know Can we lose in memory and functionality? Can we look up Nikki Haley? This is the woman he's talking about. What the fuck is that? When he said... Yeah, let's see if she's in her prime. She's not in her prime. <laughs> she looks like a senator from the oh, governor of South Carolina. Yeah, Jesus. Go to images too. She's the governor of South Carolina. This is personal. I mean, well, as a journalist, right? You're supposed to tell the truth. You're supposed to do research. Can we get... Uh, better, let's get a better picture. Because this is like... You She's asking mid-talk. for her to not say that we're in a problem. She's mid-talk. Like, let's get a better picture. Hmm. It's not that many better ones, man. See what happens if we... What's her name? Nikki Haley? See if we... Google Prime Nikki Haley. <laughs> hmm. Peak Nikki Haley. Nigga. If, you know how Prime LeBron James is like, last two with Miami. Two, 2012. Last two with Cavs and yeah. the first two with the Miami. I don't think she Wait, ever had oh, a prime. Wait, oh, the Justin. picture with Don Lemon, right there. Uh, no, nah, to the, the other one. That's to the right of that. Yeah, right there. Yeah, she's smiling and shit. I think she on the right. Oh, yeah, no. Nah, Yo, Don Lemon has the same mannerisms as my grandma. Oh, in this picture, he damn sure do. And the same haircut. And the same turtleneck. Same haircut. Yeah, oh. my grandma got a little seal. <laughs> she, 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 got a, uh, she got a line like that? Yeah, sharp. She wear it well. So grandma smooth. <laughs> Damn. Like she she's not in her prime, but like I don't think she had a prime. I'd fuck her, you know, to get a law passed. Yeah, for South Carolina. Yeah, South Carolina. You know, for some local legislation, you would take one for the team. 
She's only 51, but then again, you know, you th- that's typically removed from your prime. Yeah. yeah. LeBron is not going to be in the NBA when he's 51. Yeah, no. He's past his prime. You can't say things. There's nothing wrong with being past. And, and prime. you know what? You know what people don't realize? Your prime changes because yeah. what's considered prime changes. Like, like I'm. There's different levels of prime. So like my prime physical nature is going to change, but my prime mentally, mentally is is spiritually is, on, is going to elevate. You know what I'm saying? And then also yeah. monetarily, like mm-hmm. I'm in like men. We normally don't get to to the bread till we like 45. Literally 45, 30. You know what, you know what I mean? Yeah. So See, I nigga, thought I was in my sexual prime when I was in high school because I was getting erections like like nigga. Like I was just manifesting them. It's just busting that another erection, busting that another erection. But but I didn't really learn the game. I was about to say until I was in my young twenties. Like you on how to you know on how to fuck. Yeah, it's like I was my most my most athletic in high school. Yeah, this is metaphorically speaking for sex. But I was my most on, like you know just pure raw talent you know, physically. The game, but I know skills now. But the game changes, like you said, the game changes when you get older. The game changes when you get older because you're playing a different game. Yeah, yeah, it gets more strategic, and like, you're thinking about the long term consequences. Which Don Lemon didn't think about because he probably was like, man, this bitch is old. You know what I mean? A gay black man should be able to say whatever you, he needs to say. He should Especially be. Especially when he's Don Lemon. There's only a couple of him. Mm-hmm. It's not. Do you think it's something about the stance that he's taking? Like uh, when you when you when you appear to be morally virtuous, like nobody's coming yeah. to us for the politically correct banter. Exactly. They know that we're gonna say how we actually feel. Mm-hmm. But if you are reading the script every day and then you go out of that script, you can't be mad that they mad at you. Yeah. You're not playing your role no more. It's like imagine if Denzel played a movie where he wasn't fast talking and, and saying nonsense. It's like uh, when Pee Wee Herman, he got caught, I think, beating his dick. Hmm. Y'all know Pee Wee Herman? Pee Wee Herman. Mm-hmm. He, that sound like a nigga that get caught masturbating. He got caught beating his dick, but he he worked like, yeah. just Where did he get caught beating off at? I don't know if that's what happened, but he got caught. Doing something, I should have used the the subway guy. That's a better example. Subway like guy, he, he got caught. He, he was know. all about. He was supposed to be all about sandwiches, but then you know he was a pedophile. Yeah, he was a pedophile. He was all about juice boxes in the end. Yeah, yeah, salami. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Pee Wee show, but yeah, like he was working with kids, and you know he got caught being his dick. You can't do that. You can't do that. Those two don't mix at all. Nah, you know what I mean. But okay, because what if there's a teacher doing only fans? Yeah, because you you have no you have no problems with that. Mm-hmm. What's that word? You have no qualms. No quarrel with that. Yeah, no quarrels. Yeah, at all, nigga. Mm-hmm. But I'm also not a parent, and that may change. That may change. But as of now, like if you're a teacher, mm-hmm. what you do outside of teaching should not you know correlate with what happens in the classroom. You know, if you're sucking fucking having orgies outside, that's cool. Mm-hmm. That might, I feel like that'll make her a better person. Yeah, because teachers live a miserable life to begin with. So yeah. if you're busting more nuts, you probably come to homeroom a little more cheerful, a little more optimistic. They say uh, women in like powerful roles like that, they're usually the freakiest in bed. Y'all have a little bit, y'all a little bit older. Is that? Yeah, y'all probably deal with some more powerful women. How y'all feel about that? They usually like a little a more lawyer, sexually inclined. A lawyer is going to fuck you better than like a McDonald's employee? <laughs> I don't know, cause th- there's still truth to the like the trauma thing. Like just a woman in general who's de- dealt with some sort of trauma, like oh. has issues, will always kind of give you that box on a different level. Yeah. But like powerful women, they do like um, when a man takes the power, cause they're so used to being in power all the time. Yeah, yeah. So if you're able to assume that role for them, they'll probably let you do whatever the fuck you want. <laughs> it's normally not as enjoyable to be around though. Yeah, you. So yo, the, the like pussy's, the pussy's good, but like, I don't want to hang out with you. I'm, I'd rather hang out with the chick at McDonald's. Because some of them bitches you know be she gonna roll a blunt or something. Exactly. Yeah, it's just like because outside of bed, she gonna start saying slick shit to you because she used to bossing niggas around. Then you got a reminder, bitch. I don't give a fuck. I'm not your employee. Mm. You know, it's like shit like that. Yeah, they be robots. She gonna say slick shit to you like you better not flush that condom in my toilet. Yeah, bitch, like yeah, yeah. <laughs> Flush this shit down your bathtub, then. Probably can't even call her a bitch. Yeah, nah. You know what I mean? It's Miss Bitch. Yeah. <laughs> she has a 401k. And a, she's an entrepreneur. You better come with some respect. Like, you probably call her a cunt, but you better not call her a bitch. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Have you seen 